through the Word of God. And how she now helps others overcome the same addictions that she struggled with for years. But Serena Peterson has gone beyond helping only those she knows personally. She's found a way to help millions. She's now a partner with our ministry, and she's teaching her Sunday school class the importance of giving. I decided to directly um, do a, a partnership with Joyce Meyer. It's because of all everything she's fed into my life from the time that I was a drug addict, living in Las Vegas. It's just important to give back where you've been given, I think. I was blessed to go to India with the Joyce Meyer team and for once to, to be completely out of myself, to think, wow, I think I had a bad childhood, don't I? Woe is me. Oh my goodness. You hear about poverty and you know you've seen it, but going across the world, Green and home video. having little children around you coming up and asking you for something to eat, it's devastating. It, it, it really brings life into perspective for you. And that was the emotion that I really wanted my kids here in America, in my class, to understand the burden that it had put on my heart that just for $5 a month, a kid can eat every day, go to school every day, have clean water every day, learn a little bit about reading and writing, but learn the Word of God every day for $5 a month. And I asked them to go around the class, $5 a month, what, what is the last time you spent $5? And to see it dawn on them that, well, I just went to the movies and that didn't even buy my movie. What do you mean they don't get to eat every day? What do you mean they don't have a warm bed at night? I know that they kind of get caught up thinking, but I'm just a little kid, what can I do? And I knew as soon as they found out um, that they could be part of something bigger than themselves, um, that they would jump in. And sure enough, uh, the idea started, bake sales, garage sales. It's really changed the kids' lives. I've been able to see um, dealing with them directly and then just interacting with them throughout the week and hearing their own parents come up and share with me, wow, it was neat to see, you know, my daughter on, on fire for this. And just from a little bit of effort, how they can they can change the world. They can change the world from a small town in the middle of the United States. This is a ministry who is feeding and taking care of people, changing lives. It is an honorable program. Joyce Meyer Ministries has integrity and character, and they have it set up. If you are partnered with them, the, the money that you send every month is going directly into the stomachs of starving kids. It's so hard to believe, and I understood that. I was a little bit like that. It is so hard to comprehend that 10 20 $50 a month is really making a difference, but it is. Yeah, I saw it. I was there. I was interacting with these people. They were popping up over walls. They were in these hovels of, like, no poverty that I've ever seen in the United States before. And so even though it makes you feel good and, and you know you're making a difference, um, I equally left with the same feeling, though, but there's so much more to do. There is power in partnership. There is power in covenant. It's biblical. And when you are joined in with somebody, not only do you help them, you also gain the spiritual benefits, I believe, from what they're doing. And where would any of them be? Where would those little kids be without the partners? If it wasn't for partners, giving like they do, I might not be sitting here today like I am. I mean, if they had not empowered Joyce Meyer to spread the word, to make it available like they had, where would I be without that information? Where would I be? Well, you know, as a minister, and, and I've been doing this for lots of years, I work hard, and it's so wonderful to see a testimony like the Rena's, to see that the Word of God changes people and brings them to a full circle, so to speak, where here's somebody whose life was just messed up, God healed her, but she didn't just stop at enjoying her healing. Nope. She now wants to get the process complete by reaching out yes, and helping I other do. people. Thank you, Jesus. So I'm encouraging you.